impromptu full day of eating high day and refeed these fuckers. These guys are being jokesters. <laughs> um, episode 14. That's it. Hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> I did. I've almost shot. I've about shit my pants three times. <laughs> that needs to be the preview. Yeah. <laughs> See you guys on the next one. <laughs> Good morning, guys. I am halfway awake. Literally halfway awake. Um, it is a little after 7 a.m. On Monday, July 1st. So we are 19 days out from the show. I have hit a new low weight for two days in a row. Um, I'm, well, I was a new low weight yesterday after the guest pose in the show. And then uh, I stayed at that weight today, into today as well. So Matt has programmed in a high carb day and a refeed. As you guys can see, my diet face is coming in. <laughs> For sure, I'm literally starving right now. So without further ado, I'm gonna take you guys through a full day of eating today. Um, we've got a big carb day as well as um, five guys tonight for a refeed. So me and some of the guys are gonna be doing five guys tonight, but I'm gonna take you guys through a full day of eating, 19 days out, high carb day, and burger and fry refeed. It's going to be a lot of fun. So stay tuned and come with us today as we take you through High Carb Day. Let's go get it. Mashed up. All right, so meal one. It's eight o'clock. Hopefully, you guys can hear me all right. Meal one, high carb day. Five whole eggs. So I go with four eggs. Let's see if you guys can see that. I go with four eggs scrambled. Um, and then when I get five whole eggs, the fifth one I actually do over medium over easy and then I break the yolk in the scrambled eggs so good I also put on here salt pepper uh, the cheddar the nacho cheddar popcorn seasoning and then something Alexa just turned me on to was adding everything bagel seasoning to the eggs really fire so I've got my five whole eggs. I've got 140 grams of cream of rice, one whole apple. Um, I'm using the Pride Foods creamy peanut butter uh, cream of rice. You guys can get that at Next Level Subs or online, pridefoods.org. You guys can use Epler 10 if you need to pick some up. So this is still pretty hot right now. I also put some cinnamon and some sugar-free maple syrup. So I flatten this out. I'm gonna let this cool, eat the eggs first. Then I've got my cup of coffee. I've got all my supplements here. Pro tip, every time I need to take supplements, I put them all in a shot glass, and that way I know exactly what I need to take, and it's a little bit easier to carry around. So let's eat, stop starving. Cool, and we're back. Meal number two. Um, it is a little after 11.30, so I'm trying to speed things up just a little bit because I've got a lot of food to eat today. Wifey. What? It's wifey. Are we're you wiping? Here. I'm recording. Hi. I'm the camera's recording. Oh, it's right here. Hi. <laughs> There's the dog. Oh, and... <laughs> said hi. That smells really good. Yeah, I'm recording. I'm uh, doing my second meal. Yeah? Coffee's right. inside? Yes. Fuck yes. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, baby. She just got done doing her cardio, so she's very excited for her coffee Starbucks that I got her. Okay. 
So, as we were saying, let's get back to it. Meal two, um, we've got eight ounces of chicken breast. I do the St. Elmo's blackened seasoning on this. Hopefully you guys can see that there. Oh yeah, that looks good. What lives in your mind rent free? Buttery crispy crust. Baked on a buttery uh, crispy crust. <laughs> Damn. All right, what's up, guys? We're back for meal three. It is about 1:30, 1 uh, 1:45. We've got 200 grams of jasmine rice, and then I have eight ounces of shrimp, or I can do lean fish at this meal so I uh, get all my meats again you guys know from not your mama's meal prep um, they do the shrimp for me as well and it is fantastic I've been so happy with it um, and plus shrimp and fish are just sometimes a little tedious to cook and you go through it really quick so it's been really awesome really awesome and a huge time saver having um, them doing all my fish and then the sauce on here, I just have some sugar-free uh, barbecue sauce, the Sweet Baby Ray's. Um, I really like spicy barbecue shrimp. So for this, I wanted to bring out um, some seasonings to show you guys. On this meal right here, I've got the St. Elmo's blackened seasoning. So you guys can see that there. There we go, perfect. This is one of my favorite that I use on chicken. I use it um, on shrimp, on cod, or whatever fish I'm doing. That one's fantastic. If you guys can see that there. Um, uh, and then I did bring out some other ones that are not on this meal. So like I said, on this meal, I have the blackened seasoning and then the sugar-free barbecue sauce. Super simple, but really tasty. And then these are some other options that we, me and Lex, like to use uh, when we're doing fish or shrimp. So I wanted to show you guys some options here. This one is a sesame and ginger crunch with garlic. It's really good. It has kind of like an Asian, you know, kind of zing to it, I guess you would say. Um, then a couple other garlic options. This one's just garlic and herb. This is the Mrs. Dash. It is salt free. So, pro tip, if you guys are getting into peak week, and I'll show you guys that there. Perfect. So if you guys are getting into peak week and you have to restrict sodium, but you still want your food to taste good, this one is gonna be the way to go. Um, another one, this is the Weber's Garlic Parmesan Seasoning, and it is really really good zero calories on these as well and then lastly you've got like a lemon pepper um, there's a lot of different brands so if you have a specific brand that you like um, you can use whatever brand it doesn't really matter um, but this one's a good one it's Lowry's lemon pepper um, sometimes I'll put dill with this as well so give you guys some seasoning options that you can try on your fish or your shrimp or really just whatever, whatever you want. I mean, a lot of these are good on turkey and chicken steak, whatever. All right, meal number three. It's about 1.30. We will eat this. And then the next one is a fun one because the muffin man's coming back. Back again for another meal. It's 3.45 p.m. Going down on meal four. And this is the one that I am, one of the ones that I'm most excited about, obviously. You know, muffins. 
Yeah, so I get a bakery muffin. I told you guys, the muffin man was back. And these are becoming more and more frequent. And I'm not mad about that. We're going back in with the Costco muffin this time, guys. Let me see if I can show this off here. There we go. Oh, yeah. Check that thing out, guys. Costco. This is their coffee cake muffin. This thing is so good. Oh, my gosh. It's taking everything in my power to not eat this right now. Check out who just came out. Hey. I, I need to ask a favor of you. Okay. What's up? Um, so I have lotion on my hands. I know I have muscles, but I just I can't open my lid. Don't worry about it. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, okay. <laughs> like, like, every time I was trying to grip it, my hands were just slipping, yeah, you know? Yeah. Stupid All right, I'm getting into this meal right now. Hell yeah. I got my cream of rice almost done. All right, nice. Yeah. Okay. So we're about to have a pre-workout meal. Gonna go hit some back. Meal number four, let's get into it. Another 200 grams of rice. This time we have eight ounces of top sirloin steak from Not Your Mama's Meal Prep. Um, and on this, guys, I just went ahead and put some mild uh, Taco Bell sauce, zero calorie. It's like 25 milligrams of sodium, so it's like nothing really good um, and they have all of their sauces too like you can do the Taco Bell Verde you can do mild they have the hot the fire oh, I can't remember the I can't remember the hottest one Diablo I think they have Diablo as well in the bottle anyway uh, I just go with mild or hot on this meal then we're going down with a Costco coffee cake Muffin these are a little bit bigger than your standard um, Like four pack of muffin that you're gonna get at the regular grocery store um, but yeah Let's get into it because I'm excited and then we're training back and then I'll hit you guys with post-workout meal and then burgers tonight I'm almost done with my meal. And this thing's staring at me. And it's still a little warm. So, I'm gonna break it open for you guys. It's probably gonna make a mess, but. Man. I contemplated not doing this. But, it's for YouTube, so. We're gonna show it off for you guys. Give the people what they want to see. All right, here we go. Hopefully you guys can see that. There we go. Oh, it's a fail. Oh my gosh. That thing is massive. Look at that, guys. <laughs> Love these things. This one's the coffee cake. All right, let's get into this thing. Oh my God. Mm. Wow. Holy shit. That's fire. Oh, I forgot how good these are. Mm. Mm. Got to really try not to eat it way too fast. All righty. Just like that back for another meal meal number five it is post-workout 
fantastic workout today. Um, definitely because of <laughs> all the food that I've been eating. So I'm on my fourth liter. Again, I've had some other um, drinks throughout the day and then a pre-workout and then my intra-workout drink. So I'm getting close to a gallon of fluid already in. This will put me over a gallon and then we're just going to do one more meal tonight and you guys know what that is. It's the refeed coming up. So right now it's 7.30 p.m. Meal number five. Here's what we got. We've got a huge serving of jasmine rice again. It's 300 grams of jasmine rice. That's cooked weight. Um, and then we've got eight ounces of chicken breast. I put on this that same teriyaki marinade. Um, my Himalayan pink salt, the chicken, I put a little bit of onion powder and then just the regular St. Elmo seasoning. And then I've also got a low calorie ranch that I like, um, but I just do half a serving on the chicken. So nothing to it but to do it. Nothing crazy here. Just getting in post-workout meal. I'm gonna slam this down. And then we're heading over to Five Guys in about 90 minutes. Um, actually a little bit more than that, like close to two hours from now. Uh, be meeting the guys over there. So Shane's gonna go Christian and Leon. So Let's get in get this meal and See you guys On the way to five guys We just pulled up and I'm gonna film my camera guy. Look at this like fit check. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally eating while I'm trying to unpack it. I need to stop. So I'm gonna show you guys. It's an awesome meal. Diet Dr. Pepper Cherry is the go to for the drink. We got a regular fry and a little fry. We got a double bacon cheeseburger with barbecue sauce, lettuce, pickle, green pepper. It's really good. In the off season, I'll get jalapeno, but in prep, it's a no-go. Let's eat. We got the crew here. Here we go, turn the camera and say what's up dudes, Shane. Shane, it's right on Shane. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, oh, dude, that's funny. The way he turned around so slow to, to the camera. Yeah, that's hilarious. I'll get it back on my tree for you guys, let you see the good stuff. There we go. She'll end up being right. She'll end up being right. <laughs> and then what would happen to those fries? She'll, she'll be get she'll wasted, be right. and I would just have to stare at her. That's true. Yeah. Ooh, extra barbecue sauce. Yo, this is this is gonna be a clutch move. Worst case scenario, 
if you're still hungry, maybe stop and get a rice crispy for that. We're totally good. We should have taken a. Oh, we got footage. We got footage, yeah. We got footage of the Crescent Room. We should have got stuff, and then Chris was like, dude, I'm, uh, I was there. I'm fucking there, <laughs> yeah. bro. Like, no, thanks. yeah. I forgot. <laughs> 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 I'm like giving, I'm going like this to you. <laughs> and you're like. <laughs> I took. Yeah, so. It was good, man. It's I've been feeling. It seems like always at the end of prep, you start to feel a little bit more grateful. You start to think about the emotions get a little higher, the, the pressure gets builds a little bit. So it's fun because I really enjoy this time. Maybe not maybe not the hard guy I do things all the time, but I always really enjoy this time because it's like you get to you kind of start to cut out the extra in the schedule and then when you have more downtime you start to think about you know, the process of getting through the whole prep and I know. I need them. Epic. I need to get one of those framed in the gym by the pool and put the Olympia and put the Olympia like logo on the corner of it or something. That'd be cool. That's me. Sorry, guys. Now, and now I'm crashing. Crashing. That was a full day of eating. Two weeks, four days out now. Chicago Pro, so 18 days. Chicago Pro is freaking wild. One way per day. One way per day. 45 days a week. I mean, 45 <laughs> days a week. Yeah. This is going to be episode. <laughs> yep, we're, we're sneaking this one in. It was an impromptu full day of eating, high day, and refeed. These, these guys are being jokesters. <laughs> um, episode 14. That's it. Hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> I do I've show. almost have a bad shit my pants three times. <laughs> that needs to be the preview. Yeah. <laughs> See you guys on the next one. <laughs>